I have with me Raphael Sukhanik. Raphael, tell us about the major significant developments in broadband over the last few years. Things are really happening in Poland, aren't they? Uh, Poland is one of the biggest telecommunication market in Europe. The value of it is over uh, 9 billion euro. There is a lot of potential in this market. Uh, almost 50% of households uh, are in the range of uh, infrastructure um, capable of delivering internet above 30 megabit per second. But on the other side, there is a still huge problem uh, with uh, access uh, to the broadband in rural areas. Uh, that's uh, why uh, we addressed uh, to, this, to, this, to this matter, to this problem, uh, funds uh, under EU budgetary 2007-2013. It is uh, over 1 billion euro dedicated for uh, network, um, uh, for deployment of uh, broadband uh, networks, uh, especially in rural areas. Uh, by the end of, of 2015, we are going to build, to finalize uh, 58,000 uh, kilometers of broadband. Mostly of them, it will be, uh, mostly of them, the project will be based on optical fiber uh, technologies. So, so FTTH is really starting to happen in Poland? Exactly, yes. Uh, thanks to these projects, uh, this will be um, especially uh, backbone and distribution networks. We pave uh, the way uh, for last mile projects in the new EU budgetary perspective 2014-2020. And for this perspective, we allocated another 1 billion euro and uh, under the program Digital Poland, uh, co-financed by European uh, funds. Uh, and uh, thanks to these projects, uh, we are going to, to cover the area with the population. Uh, we want to bring the access for uh, almost four million Poles, thanks to these projects from this new budgetary perspective. Wow, and are we talking about sort of super fast broadband here? Yes, uh, uh, we speak um, uh, uh, about uh, the internet above 30 megabit per second and additional uh, ranking points will be uh, uh, granted to the projects uh, which assure the internet over 100 uh, megabit per second. Sounds like uh, Poland is the place to be for broadband, Rafael. Um, uh, po po uh, Poland is uh, uh, a good place for uh, investors, for telecom operators, for vendors of telecom uh, infrastructure, and also for construction companies. Uh, they should use the opportunities uh, coming uh, with this, with this, uh, with this uh, public uh, support for the telecom sector in Poland. Rafael, thank you very much for joining us today. Thank you, Brian. So a very interesting perspective there of where EU funding is making a real difference to a country.